Hello everyone, welcome to Beauty in the Garden. I'm T. So right behind me is my garden supplies. I had a great deal of questions about my organization and what was on my shelves. So what was on my shelves that you guys seen in um, my planting germination videos is my supplies for my hair care. But over here, is where I actually have all my garden supplies. Oh, so I'm gonna start right here. So everything on the shelf, you guys, I caught on sale almost to the penny, to the dollar, okay? Always try the best to shop out of season, save as much money as you can. Um, this is the way to go. Um, I did not purchase any of this stuff at full price. I try to catch every single thing I get on sale. Um, now, if you definitely do need it um, and you don't have it, then go ahead and purchase what you need. But um, over the years, I have accumulated <laughs> supplies. So I wanted to show you guys, this is my supplies. Now I show you guys, I purchased these from Lowe's and I show you guys these on sale. This is the Dr. Earth. Um, disease control this is the uh, fungicide right here um, that I caught on sale uh, let's see which one is this one this is the dr. earth vegetable and insect killer um, this is all organic here and as well I have a little bit left in here but this is the Maggie's farm um, organic spray for what they have here uh, they have um, for aphids, calipelia mites, and so forth and so on. Um, back here is the Miracle Grow Nature Care um, Organic Fertilizer. Um, right behind that is the Doctor's Earth Granulate Fertilizer that you see there. Um, Diatomaceous Earth. I think I actually got this, you guys. I think for like a dollar a bag or something like that. So great deal on that. I got three of those. Um, my um, Miracle Grow sprayers. I do have a couple more over uh, at my table that I'm working on now. But I have them labeled. Uh, one right here. I have one labeled for BT. Then the other two here. I have. See says fungicide and what is this one labeled this one is labeled water slash bug killer so that means i put bug killer in here with half water and then the other two right here are just for water and then the one that i'm using right now is just water um over here down here i have for my fruit trees um i caught this is on a great deal as well um these are the fruit and citrus plant food steaks that i got i have like six of those um the expert garden organic uh 356 np and k um oh back here is my favorite you guys i can't wait to i didn't catch any on sale you guys Job's organic is like my number one go-to um, I just love Job's Organic and I did not catch any of it on sale. So if I did really have to go buy some and I really, really want it, I'm going to go get my Job's Organic. So I got my Job's Organic right here. This is the bone meal. Okay, this is for flowers back here. It's no particular flower really. You can use this for on any flower you want. That's by Job's Organic. All right. And then here is called some soil moist i have never used this i got it it's for indoor and outdoor use it is supposed to um help um retain moisture it's supposed to absorb and release water into soil never used it i had it for a while you can kind of tell um but um when i find a use for it you guys i will use it but right now i have no use for it but i do have it so um, let's put that back over here. Um, I have some evergreen tree and shrub plant food, which you guys see that deal on them. I really caught a lot of great deals on my fertilizer. This is for your evergreens. Over here is the Garden Expert, um, Expert Gardener. 
um, plant food. This is a 12, 10, 5. I have a great deal of that. And back there is my Job's Organic Vegetable and Tomato. Uh, let's see what I got down here. Let's see. So down here, you guys. Y'all like my little thing? Little Beauty in the Garden. Um, so I have here some Expert Gardener plant food. This is a 19612 um, fertilizer. I did use it one time. Um, it did work really well. I like to use my synthetics on my flowers as much as possible. Um, I ran into the Miracle Grow Performance Organics. I have like three of those. Let's see, I'll slide that back. And then I have a ton of the Doctors Earth Pump and Grow. Um, I. I just literally ran a great deal. Let me see if I can find a sticker that might be still on it. No, uh, 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 I thought maybe I had a sticker still on it, or at least one of them. But I do not. But I did get them like, I think a dollar and some change uh, for these um, pump and go for these pump and grows right here. Um, I did purchase this right here. It's a fast um, acting lime. This is calcium. Um, I did purchase these guys. They were a dollar twenty five a bag uh, from Lowe's. Um, back here is my blood meal by Job's Organic. I normally, you know, have Job's Organic, like five or six bags of that. Um, this year, I will not have that because I didn't run into a great deal on it. And um, yeah, I'm going to be a little sad if I want to run out of it. But I have something in place of that. But hopefully, I will get some more of that, okay? Okay, so back here, I have two giant bags of earthworm castings. I do have all of these items, you guys, pretty much besides the expert gardener um, in my description box below of some of the items that I use, okay? Okay, so down here is, hello, my lovely fish fertilizer. Okay, I love this fertilizer. This is a 511 NP and K. I use this faithfully. Um, I normally have about uh, four bottles of this right here, but I don't. I just have two. I have some Osmocote back here. I have some Shake and Feed Rose Blossoms, Shake and Feed All Purpose, and then the Shake and Feed Tomato and Fruit and Vegetable Fertilizer. This right here is the fungicide that I use as of right now for my roses. And I will be getting another one. Um, I had this for a great deal of time. I still got a good bit in here. But this is a great one too for your roses. Okay. Now you can use like rosemary um, to, you know, get rid of the, um, to get rid of uh, some of those issues with, with roses and getting funguses and stuff like that. Let's go over to the next shelf. So this is this shelf here. You guys, it's all in my garage. Okay, so this is this shelf. Um, what is this called? Okay, this is the Espoma. I have it here with a couple of bags um, got damaged and I just put it in those containers. All right, go on to the next side. Okay, so right here I have a massive amount of gloves, a crazy amount of sprayers here. Um, pads to kneel um i caught these on sale you guys um at dollar general then i have some more of uh, these little sprayers here um water pitchers here um uh, this product here i have the triple super phosphorus um this is 045 and then over here they have a potassium which is a 0060 um i'm not sure yet um i did open it to see what it looks like um but this is the first time um i have it in here i did get this a great deal as well um at our uh local nursery 
all right so down here is the organic tomato tone by espoma this is what i have you guys in the container um that i just showed you guys that's this then i have all these little sprayers here that i got as well um which i'll probably just use this as a bug sprayer because it does a great deal of misting then down here is uh my sea starts that i told you guys i went ahead and tried this out and yeah here we go we got this right got here light shine so i have this right here that i end up getting for 40 cents and i have like four left and i will be using those um and as well um my bt i like using the bt for my cabbage and i use uh this brand as well right here for my cabbages and let's see what else i found this on sale i don't have any palms uh but i will always find use of having supplies um regardless if i use it or not right now um i actually picked this up for like 75 cents and, and i think it's like i don't know like five maybe eight dollars for this i picked it up anyways put it on my show never know when i'm gonna need anything um then in my <laughs> uh simply orange juice i have bug killer rosemary spray that i just shake this up and make a little mix and i just have little containers like that so try to save some of your jugs um especially if you're trying to mix um some of your things and you don't want to put it in a bucket just save some of these um your containers especially the clear ones so you can see the product in it uh, especially like i think uh, tropicana has a clear one as well so try to find a clear container and reuse it and use it for your garden um i definitely use that and i had someone that said that a while i never thought about using your parmesan cheese shaker i use the parmesan cheese shaker to shake uh, my worm castings on top of my bed and to work it in it gives me like a nice little even things you guys that i have uh, supply wise and I wanted to show you guys, this is my organization system. A deal, um, always look out for a deal. Rather, um, you into purchasing uh, or not, or using it rather, or if you're using it or not, um, think in the long run. Don't think short, think in the long run. What would you use? Uh, could you use it later on? Are you thinking about getting things and uh, you end up with extra supplies? And right here, I forgot, this is the miracle Grow um, right here that I have. Um, I only use a very teeny bit of this stuff. I've had it forever. Um, but yes, and it's, it's just literally had it for a long, long time. <laughs> so definitely, um, definitely use what works for you. This right here. Um, I end up picking it up for 20 cents at uh, Dollar General when they had the 90% off. And this is the um, the Job's Organic Houseplant Steaks. So, and I ended up getting 50 for 25. So this was a great deal. I ended up finding two of them and I brought them home. Whenever I, I want to use things, I will definitely be using them. And um, I do have some house plants that I'm starting to incorporate into the home. So I definitely will be just popping these little babies in. So I hope you guys enjoyed my tour of supplies and my organization system. I tried to keep everything so I can see it. So I hope you guys enjoy. Please don't forget to give the video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell so you can be notified when I do upload a video. And remember you guys, there's beauty in everyone's garden. And bye-bye for now.